Hi, I'm Jonathan Boyd. The bowspring practice makes traditional yoga poses more accessible. For example, twists are less deep. Instead of twisting the belly like rinsing out a wet dishcloth, bowspring twists are more upright, embrace the natural inward curve of the lower back, and promote ribcage expansion in all directions for a fuller breath. Why would I treat my organs like a wet dishcloth? Phoenix pose is more accessible than eagle. With the hands holding the elbows in genie arms, there is less strain on the shoulders. Kickstanding the foot makes it more stable and promotes strength in the legs. Accessible is defined as capable of being reached or obtained. Straightening the legs in Uttanasana can put undue stress on the lower back. Keeping the feet wide and bending the knees creates slack in the hamstrings to arch your back. Yoga is trending towards more difficult postures, deeper stretches, quicker pace, and tighter binds. Crouching cat positions the arms in the front plane of the body and bends the knees, making it easier to be light and active compared to downward facing dog. Yoga is not a competition. Unless you're better than everyone, then it is. Seated hip openers and forward folds from classical yoga aren't common in bowspring. Why is Gumby used as inspiration in yoga? To recharge your batteries, try standing in recovery pose. It's less pressure on the knees and hips than child's pose. Why is it called child's pose? Has anyone ever seen a child in child's pose? Running around and playing is child's pose. Use props to propel the progress of your practice. Sometimes I sit on about 10 blocks. It simulates standing. Instead of dropping back into camel, stay more upright in kneeling position. It's more powerful and easier to breathe. What is Gumby? The higher elevation of the hips and falcon creates less pressure on the front knee than pigeon. With the back knee closer, there is less pull on the psoas of the back leg. Although the bowspring shapes are more accessible, they require a sharpened mind and a playful attitude.